Things are definitely heating up for 509 fabrication in Post Falls. And we are the ones manufacturing the brand new uh, world's first Presto log burning stove. The stove originated in a garage in Hayden around 2010, but it wasn't until the very end of 2017, after years of testing with the EPA and meeting UL standards, that 509 Fabrication was given the green light to start selling its stove. So we've tested this stove every which way that you could burn this stove, trying to make it burn dirty, and uh, they couldn't do it. Further validation came in March at the National Hearth Patio and Barbecue Show in Atlanta. And they vote on what they think is the best new marketable product of the year, and we actually came home with that award. Dusty Henderson says 509 stove is one of the most fuel efficient in the world. You're pulling all of the fuel heat off of the stove instead of running it out the exhaust pipe outside. You simply feed the logs through the top of the stove so there's no pitch, no bugs, and no splinters like you'd get with the wood stove. And there's almost no cleanup either. And it burns all night long on a load of fuel that you don't have to clean it out but about once every two weeks. It actually vaporizes the fuel. 509 Fabrication begins by welding the stainless steel parts for its stoves from start to finish. It paints everything with a special Senotherm paint from Germany. The, the doors, the front plates, everywhere. In its own in-house paint booth. The stoves are then finished in assembly. We uh, design our own uh, electrical harness and then we're having a company that's just across the freeway uh, put those together for us and then we install them on the stove. Henderson says the stoves can be used in your home, your shop or your cabin. Wherever you want to put this stove, it'll heat up to 2,500 square feet. It's, um, it's meant to put out a nice even heat like a wood stove. Priced at just over $3,000, it's meant to be a lifetime stove. 509 Fabrications made its first ever delivery of four stoves to Yakima earlier this month. It's the first of what they hope will be many deliveries in 2018. And we've got uh, dealers and distributors all over the country right now that, that want to carry the stove. We're just ramping up to, to start serving them. Henderson also hopes to start selling in Europe soon. And he's working on a log chipper and some different stove models. That will come to market probably in three to four years. Um, top secret stuff. <laughs> yeah. Which means the heat should stay on for 509 fabrication for quite some time. For Maine the Northwest, I'm Derek Dice, KXOY 4 News.